हेलो माई सेल्फ विराज विजय कुंड आई एम स्टूडेंट ऑफ श्री कॉलेज ऑफ इंजीनियरिंग पंडरपुर कंप्यूटर साइंस डिपार्टमेंट डिविजन ई बिफोर स्टार्ट प्रोग्राम आई वुड लाइक टू गिव ओवर व्यू ऑफ माई प्रोग्राम वी ऑल नो दैट टूडे सम स्टूडेंट ऑलवेज फॉर गेट देयर वीकली टाइम टेबल एज वेल एज होमवर्क एंड दे कुड नॉट अंडरस्टैंड अबाउट फी सो दैट प्रोग्राम आर यूजफुल फॉर दो स्टूडेंट लेट स्टार्ट the first thing you will notice in first line that hash include hash include is free processor that includes header file here this tdio.h header file it's also known as standard input output library int main return some value int is integer data type and e number and no are integer data type variable print function is used to print char float integer string on to the output screen here i give three choices for user first choice weekly time table second choice fin query and third one homework the fourth print function is detect that enter number for above instruction scanner function is used to get input from user percentage d is format specific for integer and is used to address number here if else if ladder is used if that number is equal to is equal to 1 that logical condition is true then statement into the if condition are executed if that condition is false then it goes to else if if number is equal to is equal to 2 that condition is true then statement into else if is printed if that also false then is goes to another else if if number is equal to is equal to 3 that logical condition is true then statement into the else if is executed here that all condition is false then else statement into the executed first of all let's see if number is equal to is equal to 1 that condition is true if that condition is true then print welcome to weekly time table on to the output screen and here also 1 to 7 choices from user if user print 1 then they are stored in low variable here switch case is used switch statement allow a variable to be tested for equality against list of value here Uh, accordingly 1 to 7 case first case for monday second one tuesday third one wednesday fourth one thursday fifth one friday sixth one saturday seventh one sunday and the last default means that all cases are not matching so the statement into default is please enter a correct choice uh, let's see uh, if user input is 1 for weekly time table then what if user uh, input is 1 for weekly time table then they have one to seven choices if here user input is 1 uh, then all monday schedules are uh, printed on output screen 8:30 to 9 prayer 9 to 10 english 10 to 11 hindi 11 to 11:30 break 11:30 to 12:30 math 12:30 1:30 social science that all monday schedule are printed to the output screen if user get two input for fin query let's see what happen uh, uh, then is two for fin query then main input is two then all fin query are printed to the output screen uh, total fee and remaining fee if user print three for homework let's see what happen if user print 3 for a uh, homework then then all the homework schedule for monday to sunday are executed from output screen monday tuesday as accordingly and last message is thank you if user print uh, another number for example 4 then let's see what happen for 
then they print this intercorrect number because I give only three choices in a user only uh, your input for this three number so I hope that program are useful for those students they are always forget their uh, weekly timetable and homework uh, thank you